Hello guys! Today I want to make a video about MSG. What is MSG? MSG is a taste enhancer which is being used in a food supply and in processed food. It is um, something that um, the firms use to um, enhance the taste of meats or um, uh, something that is in the food. But it can also make bad food taste better. Um, and this is a subject I have been informing people about in Denmark for the last many months here in 2019. Uh, but somebody is trying to stop me. Uh, for a while ago, uh, around July, uh, there was a journalist who contacted me um, about uh, MSG and asked me if I um, was not uh, spreading uh, just um, fear, unnecessary fear about MSG uh, and a bunch of other questions he asked me and he actually said that um, he will only give me one day for me to answer otherwise uh, he will make me look like I didn't want to answer it's because I have a Facebook uh, site or uh, yeah, I have a Facebook uh, page on Facebook, of course. Uh, and after um, I answered him, I answered him about um, document, uh, documentation about uh, MSG, where I had the inf information from, which is from a neurosurgeon, Dr. Russell Blaylock, uh, which are informing the people about uh, MSG. Uh, he's, he didn't mention that one in... Uh, in the media um, article I got about MSG um, and he also um, changed changes uh, he made some changes in my comment uh, comment in uh, in the article there um, so after I went to the media or after this article came public to the people um, I was then validated as a fake news uh, paper on on my Facebook site, which means that I couldn't post on my wall because I should um, I should inform about my location, and I didn't want to to do that because my location where I am in the world is not important for my informing to the people about something that is harming them. Um, so, but this will not stop me. I, I will still keep on going with informing to the world about this because MSG is, according to Dr. Russell Blaylock, neurosurgeon, MSG is linked to neurological diseases and brain damage. MSG is overstimulating your nerve cells and um, I have been researching this MSG for some months, as I said before, and what I have described, what I have discovered, is no good. People, it's, it's no good. It is in all things in Denmark. It's everywhere. Everywhere I looked, these hidden names of MSG, not only just standing. MSG or monosodium mono glutamate or the E numbers for MSG. No, no, it was also uh, like citric acid, uh, maltodextrin, uh, uh, cornstarch, uh, modified uh, cornstarch, uh, food starch, uh, yeast extract, many, many other names. But I have made a list here um, about where you can find MSG in the food if you want to avoid this. So, um, I will mention them now. Um, frozen pizzas, kebab meat, also in some kebab uh, I have discovered here in Denmark, uh, those who make kebab around here. Uh, personal products, baby wipes, uh, toothpaste, 
shampoos, dish soaps, aloe vera products, liquids, soaps. Uh, some Chinese restaurants use it. Uh, so far, I have discovered eight uh, in Denmark. More will uh, be researched on. Uh, yogurts, soups, bread you can buy in the stores, cacao powder, chocolate and marzipan, cakes, cookies, chips, chips dip mix, dog supplements, candy, hard candy, throat pastels, chewing gums, vaccines, fruit cans, ketchup dips, McDonald's food, the McDonald's also use uh, MSG in uh, pommes frites, uh, in uh, some of the dips and uh, hummus and other things. I will link a link down below to uh, my McDonald's video. Um, if you want to see it uh, and I will also then uh, later on make some English subtitles on it so you can get that info. Uh, MSG is also found in organic food and vegan food. Uh, sausages, meat like Gordon Bleu, hot wings, salami, cold cuts, many kinds of cold cuts. Uh, Knorr products, processed meat or meals, noodles like cup of noodles, nuts, dairy products, tortillas, spices, uh, spices, uh, bouillon, ice cream, cancer meds. I have found one in Denmark with MSG in it. Sweetness like uh, stevia uh, and other kinds, vitamins and fish, oil, fish oils, uh, substitutes for breast, uh, so, uh, sorry, Subs substitutes for breast milk. If you want to have a natural recipe about something, uh, about um, uh, a natural recipe for uh, a substitute for your baby, you can contact me for the recipe. It's a natural one I have, which remind uh, um, much about uh, breast milk. Uh, it is in so many things in Denmark, like all over the place. And it is legal, folks. It is legal in processed food. So what are MSG uh, doing in... Um, personal products in um, in vaccines in, in in substitutes for for breast milk and everything what why are, are they putting this in all these things as i said earlier it, it is messing with your brain neurological diseases brain damages This is not okay. That's why I will keep on fighting for this case to the world about this because it is making people sick. Uh, I myself, when I get MSG, my face swallow up and I get red. I get so, you know, like there is uh, water retention in my body, uh, it chooses, uh, weight gain. When I get MSG, I cannot uh, lose weight again, uh, and um, so as soon if if as soon as I get MSG, if I get it, um, then I, my weight goes up very fast, like right away. And when I then take it away again, then my weight go down. And I have for years not could uh, lose weight until I figured out about MSG and that was the, the cause of my weight gain. So it's also uh, proven that uh, it's um, making people obese. 
Uh, the last thing I want to say here in this video about MSG is that uh, hidden names for uh, MSG is uh, citric acid, soy protein, hydrolyzed proteins, um, The E number for citric acid is E330, maltodextrin, yeast extract, cornstarch, modified starch. That's some of the names. I will link links down below to my MSG homepage, to the name list of MSG. There's a long, long list. Uh, and this homepage of mine, where you can figure out where uh, MSG is hidden in. I have many categories uh, in my homepage, also where you can um, get MSG free products, but I don't know how many of them you can get in the other countries in the world, but otherwise you can always send me photos and I can check if the MSG in it, in it or not, that you're welcome to. My, home, my email for it, if you want to contact me, is msg, um, you know, like a, a stry. Uh, a straight line uh, oplysning snabelag hotmail.com uh, otherwise you can follow me on facebook in the group msg uh, msg oplysning i will also link the, a link down below on twitter on youtube instagram oplysning on msg you can follow me there too please share this video and uh, please subscribe my channel here for more info uh, and more videos from me. Love and light from Nina Sjælens Univers. Please share this video and goodbye again. Stay safe.